Welcome to this ANSYS Innovation course, the introduction to Maxwell, intended for students getting started with electromagnetics or EM simulations. Maxwell is one of the electromagnetic simulation tools that is available inside the ANSYS Electronic Desktop, or AEDT for short. Maxwell provides you a low frequency electromagnetic solution based on your model geometry. It allows you to see and visualize many different results, not limited to, but does include the force, the torque, inductance plots, electric and magnetic field plots. And this example that we'll be discussing here is an electromagnetic break, or more specifically, an electromagnetic fail-safe break, EMB for short. And EMBs are used in many applications, including aircraft cargo door actuation systems, robotic surgery arms, commercial robots, lifts, elevators. And depending on the application and use, they're implemented in different ways. So let's look at an EMB used in a cargo door actuation system application. And the sectional view of the brake is as shown here and it's mounted concentrically with the shaft and the main parts include a magnetic steel core, a wound copper coil, fixed and movable brake plates, springs, spacer screws, and a friction pad rotate with the shaft. And when the actuator is de-energized, the EM brake holds the shaft in its place through the spring force, and when the actuator is energized, the brake plate gets pulled backwards against the spring force, and the shaft is released, allowing the shaft to rotate and move the door. Our interest here is to simulate the electromagnetic system that can produce enough force on the movable brake plate to pull it back, overcoming the spring force and it's enough to model the core, the coil, and the movable brake plate, since all the other parts will be non-magnetic and they are not needed for the EM simulation. So ANSYS offers a student version of the gold standard Maxwell simulation tool, and the student version of Maxwell is limited to the number of mesh elements, 64,000 for 3D volumes, 8,000 elements for 3D surfaces, and 2,000 triangles for 2D simulations. The transient simulation is not supported, either in 2D or 3D. So thank you for watching this video introducing you to an EM brake design for cargo door actuation application, an application to show off our Maxwell. Continue ahead to the next course on how to create this EM brake model geometry inside of Maxwell. Visit courses.ansys.com and watch our video modules on all of the ANSYS simulation tools as well as related topics.